Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of the card review. So, we got an interesting card here. I know. I mean, look at the card art. I mean, that's it. That's, that's the Crimson Dragon, isn't it? That, that's it, right? So, uh, and you're looking, you're like, that's a Synchro Monster, but it has no level. Hello? Like, that's weird. That's weird. I know. A level zero Synchro Monster. I know. I know. So, uh, we're totally going to go over this card, definitely. I know there's a, there's a XC monster that's a rent that's also rank zero. So, you're like, well, if we can do it for XCs, why can't we do it for Synchros? So, this is not Crimson Dragon. You can kind of tell by the name Ultimaya Tuskulkin? I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't even want to try that. Crimson Dragon. It's fucking Crimson Dragon. Anyway, uh, it is a Dark Dragon Synchro Effect. Level zero, I know, level zero. Zero attack, zero defense. So it has to have some beast ass effect to, you know, warrant that. Because this is supposed to be Crimson Dragon, right? Anyway, uh, the first thing. This card is always treated as a level 12. Alright, so I think like the, the rank monster, I think he's always treated as rank 1 or something. Despite having nothing. So this guy is always treated as a level 12 despite having no level at all. So another level 12 monster has joined the ranks along with Blue Eyes Ultimate and New Bell Ultimate Nightmare. Even though it has 0. So it's the first level 0, but it's also another 12. Alright, uh, cannot be Synchro Summon. Cannot be Synchro Summon. Oh, okay. So Synchro Master cannot be Synchro Summon. Whoa. Then how do I summon it? <laughs> Alright, let's go with that. Must be Special Summon from your extra deck by sending one level 5 or higher tuner monster. Alright. And one level 5 or higher non tuner monster you control with the same level to the graveyard. It cannot be Special Summon by other ways. So, you gotta have a level 5 tuner. And a, and a level 5 non-tuner, level 6 tuner, level 6 non-tuner, level 7 tuner, level 7 non-tuner. That, that, that's, how, that's how you do it. So, that's how you're going to summon this beauty. Alright. Oh, there's a summoning. How do you, what's its effect? Is it, is it good? Alright. Once per turn, when a spell slash trap card is set on your side of the field, you can special summon one power tool synchro monster or one level 7 or 8 dragon type synchro monster from your extra deck. While you control other synchro monsters, this card cannot be targeted with effects or for attacks. Interesting, interesting. So you go ahead and summon this guy, and you can go ahead and uh, set, a, set a spell or trap, and then you get to go ahead and summon a level 7 or 8 dragon synchro monster right from your extra deck. And then, of course, you can't go after this guy. You gotta take out the synchro monster first. And you better take it out quick, because next turn I'm probably gonna set another spell trap and get another summon, and set another spell trap and get another summon. So, that's pretty good. That's a pretty interesting effect. Interesting effect. Not something I would expect Crimson Dragon to do, but just an interesting effect indeed. So let's go over maybe some uh, trips and ticks, tricks on how to maybe do some interesting interestingness with this. Alright, so... I know one of the major decks that could probably pull this out is definitely um, uh, Heretics, Herotics, definitely. Uh, you know, in a Heretic deck, they got a lot of level 5s and level 6, uh, you know, normal monsters. And then, of course, with Labradite Dragon, I mean, there you go. Labradite Dragon and another level 6 normal monster, bam, there you go. You got them right there. So, not bad, not bad. Uh, you know, another deck that could probably pull him off pretty well is uh, Agent Artifacts. Well, not so well anymore because, you know, I'm not even sure if Artifact Agent, you know, Artifacts is even a thing anymore. That's the Morale Attack is that one, but that's another thing. You know, uh, you know, you can you have the, um, you know, Uranus, Uranus, the Agent of Death. It's a level 5 tuner. Then all you need to do is just summon the Artifact. Bam, there you go. You got him right there. Also, another way, of course, in a, you know, it's a Synchro Monster, Synchro Based Deck. Quick Draw. Who's level 5 plus the tricky? So there you go, that's the easy way, you know. Just special summon quick draw, special summon the tricky, you know. So, uh, you know, that's not bad. It takes a little couple of resources out of your hand because you gotta go discard special summon the tricky, then discard special summon quick draw, then go ahead and go in this guy so you don't have one card left in your hand. But then you can summon some serious dragons with this guy. So let's go ahead and actually just go down uh, the list of the, the dragons that you can actually summon with this card. All right. So, you can summon uh, Trident, Dragonity Knight Trident. I doubt you'll be doing that. Exploder Dragon Wing, I doubt it. Alright. Uh, Gunnir, I doubt it. Alright. Hot Red, that might be interesting. Hot Red. You know, you can summon that guy in defense mode, summon Hot Red, wipe the field, attack with Hot Red. No, that's not bad. Hundred Eyes, I doubt it. Inferno Gym Dragon, I don't think so. <laughs> you know. Uh, uh, 
Life stream dragon. Okay. Uh, you know, you can summon uh, uh, light and dragon. Okay. You can summon Michael. Michael. Uh, you can summon uh, moonlight. All right. You know, I mean, yeah, Moonlight Rose. All right. You can summon Red Dragon, Archfiend. Meh. Scribe Dragon. Okay. Stardust Dragon. All right. Stardust Spark. Uh, Sun Dragon. Void Ogre. And I feel like I'm missing someone who might be one of the most interesting dragons to summon. Let me see if I can find him on this list. Because you should be able to summon him, right? You can't summon uh, Beals? You can summon Beals, right? There he is. There he is. Ancient Fairy Dragon, Ancient Pixie Dragon, Beals, Black Rudrago, Black Rose Dragon, Black Wing Dragon, Black Feathered Drag. I don't know what this black is. That the the other one? Uh, Clear Wing Synchro Dragon. That's the new guy. We talk about Dark End Dragon. And then the other dragon, new dragon. So, but you can summon Beals. That's interesting. You can summon Beals. Hmm. Okay. So, like I said, the monsters have to be the same level, but you could do it. Yeah. Interesting play that you can do is uh in um in uh zombie vice. In zombie vice you can run a Labradite dragon, just throw one Labradite dragon in, and you can literally go, you know, have if you have zombie world, you can go uh you know uh summon ill blood, you know, use your normal summon for your effect, you now summon a zombie monster, which would probably be Labradite Dragon, summon it back. Ill Blood's level six, Labradite Dragon's level six, go ahead, go right into this guy. So that might be a cute little play, all you, and all you have to do is just put in one Labradite Dragon, and there you go, you know? So, there you go, there's, there's one of my own personal plays, so, yeah. Alright, so, this guy's not terrible, he's interesting, definitely interesting. So, uh, tell me what you guys think about, um, Crimson Dragon, or Ultimaya Tukul... Tzolkin? Tzolkin? I don't know. In the comment section below. So, I bet you guys enjoyed this episode of the Card Review. So thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys uh, you know, next Tuesday with another card to look at. Alright, thanks for watching.